This is a short video just showing you quickly how to create delete queries. Um, it would be quite a handy thing, uh, particularly whilst developing the database, to be able to delete the test data from the tables if you want to. Um, and an easy, kind of quick way of doing that is to, to create delete queries. <coughs> uh, the first step is to create so got a new query in design view. Add the table for which you want to delete the data from. Um, in the field drop down box, if you select the name of the table with the star, that means it will delete um, data from all of the fields in that table. The star just means everything, uh, all fields. And then go to uh, the delete query button at the top of your ribbon. So that means this query will now delete everything from the driver hobbies table in this example. I'm going to close that, save the changes, and call it delete driver hobbies. And OK. So I've now got this delete query. Uh, if I just open up the driver hobbies table, we see there's uh, eight records in there at the moment. Uh, then I just run the delete query. It says yes, it's going to modify data in the table. Yes, that's correct. It's about to delete eight rows. Yes, I want to carry on. And if I look in the driver hobbies table now, uh, you can see it's empty. Okay, if I want to populate it again, we've already created the uh, the append queries, so I could run the append query. and that's put all the data back in. So now you need to create more delete queries, a delete query for each of your tables.